Welcome back. Before the break, I asked you to guess who was the guest in the nest. Mm. Before the break, we gave you a clue. We told you today's guests put their skates on for their country. So now it's time to say mystery guests come down from the nest. That's right, Naomi and Chuck. Today's mystery guests in the nest are top figure skaters and British senior dance champions, Charlotte Clements and Gary Shortland. Hello. Welcome to the show. No, straight you. away. How did it feel to win the senior British dance championships? Very good and exciting. You know, we've done it for the second time. And um, mm. Mm. so, were you expecting it? Um, or were you just hoping? We were hoping. I mean, it was a um, very tough competition. I mean, for the second year, you've got to go in and try and defend your title. So it was a nice surprise, but it was worth it. Mm -hmm. yes. It was very well, worth let's it. Let's take a look at a clip of you in action. Do you have to be very fit to be an ice skater? Yes, definitely. Gary and I go to the gym um, every day in peak season. And um, when we're not, we go maybe twice a week, just up until our next championship. So how many awards have you actually won? Um, medals, we've won probably about... You don't have many because you, I mean, you have lots of competitions, yeah. but you may not win every one. Internationally, it's very hard to win. So, I mean, we've won, you know, four, four, four this, five. This, this, this year, yeah. yeah. Very good. Mm. Do you have to, um, if you're a dancer on dry land, would you be able to, would that be good training to be an ice skater or not? I think really? so. We, we, I mean, Gary and I, um, when we're dancing on the floor mm. and stuff, you know, mm. so you we're, do we're rhythmically do quite good. Yeah, floor, yeah, it helps mm -hmm. if you've got a rhythm off, mm -hmm. off the ice, I think, mm. or before you go on stage or on the ice Both or whatever you do. Both from dancing family as well. Mm -hmm. so, oh, right. you know. And how long does it take you to perfect a routine? Um, all season, really. Yeah, it takes all season, because, I mean, each competition may be good, but you get better for the second as one. As you go like along. we've got our last international this year so, so there's a lot of hard work yes mm. do you think you'll do this for the rest of your life um, you always do this oh yeah i mean, yeah. I mean obviously you don't compete for the rest of your life but i mean skating is our life so it will always be a part of it we'll mm. always have something to do with skating i'm sure yeah. well good luck for good the future, future. Yeah. Yeah. thank you thank so you. much for coming in thank, thank, you. thank you now it's time for around the world part one <laughs> must bring back memories. <laughs> um, a lot of it's quite different now. I mean, it's changed quite a bit, but uh, basically you, the same judges are there. <laughs> the same officials, like, the skaters have changed. And I think the standard in the ice dancing is, in the last couple of years, the top 10 standard um, are very, very high now. I think for a while the top maybe three or four were very good, and then there was a bit of a drop. But I think now they're all creeping mm. up and, and the standard is becoming much higher. And of course we have to mention the British champions here, Charlotte Clements, yes. Gary Shortland. They're good, they're lying in 16th place. Yes, they're doing well. um, I saw them perform their walls and they skated extremely well. I don't think they could have performed it any better. And it's nice to see them um, creeping up there. And I, I'm sure there's more to come from them in the future. Mm, certainly hope so, yeah. and that will be tonight. But thanks very much for joining us. Enjoy the competition if you can. But we start with the British champions. Let's join Robin Cousins and Barry Davis. British champions Charlotte Clements and Gary Shortland went to the European Championships really for the experience. This year they've retained their British title and they come here very confident, very assured and with an outside chance of even getting in the top ten. Gary and I have achieved quite a lot this year because we've had um, a different choreographer this year to work with us on um, original dance and, and free dance. So hopefully that will show in our performances this year. Right Gary, two British titles under your belt. What do you want out of this European Championship? Just to be seen and just to show that we have improved and that you know we're the couple just to keep an eye on. 